Hello there, YouTubers. So what I did there, I placed my seat. I had a couple more there. So I placed them there. In water. As you can see here. And uh, I got some bok choy. And uh, cucumbers. And the bok choy are the small one like this here. And those there those two there so they have started to germinate after two days same thing with the cucumber it started to germinate a little there so you can see a little bit of white tail going in on there same thing for this one here you're not going to see that much on the camera because they're pretty small so what I'm going to do I'm going to take uh, one of these you put them in water and uh, they grow up one for you. There we go. So they grow up like this, and they work like this. So once you put water in a container, they're gonna absorb all the water. After that, uh, you already almost got a hole there. So you just have to put a hole. After that, you grab your seeds, put them in there, and you put it into an incubator. Um, after that, I'm gonna cut them, put them into my uh, aeroponic system. Alright, so that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Hey there, YouTubers. So, uh, this is where I'm at. I got my lamp on here, and uh, my cucumbers have started to grow a lot. You can see the roots there going through and all that. So it's uh, definitely growing. Uh, those are bok choy. And you can see them good there. They're only going through a little bit. Uh, the rest of them didn't grow yet. Maybe they won't grow, but uh, it doesn't matter. I just want one or two plants to start off with. So this is where I'm at. I just placed them under the light now. And uh, I'm gonna monitor the growth after this and see if it's growing faster or slower or whatnot. Uh, this one I removed it from uh, the container because uh, it was going uh, on top of the lid here and I didn't like it. So that was not high enough for whatever reason. And here. So I didn't receive my pH tester and all that yet. So this is on standby for now. Anyway, the plants are not grown enough. So. Uh, what I'm going to do here, I'm going to do a nice silicone gasket all around. I noticed that it was uh, going through for what not reason, so it's not sealed properly. So I'm just going to put a gasket seal all around this to make sure that it's leak proof. Uh, this there, I put some epoxy so uh, the water is still there after several days, so it's not going to go any further than this. And it's the same case here. Epoxy is great. You don't have to work with it. You don't have to worry about it. And uh, I did the same thing with the injection points. And those who don't know what injection points is, is that when you have a plastic container, whatever the plastic container is, or whatever uh, plastic injection is, basically, um, let me put it that way, uh, there is a four or depending on how big the thing is, on this case there is four injection point. And uh, this is where the plastic is going to be blown inside the mold. Uh, so they just uh, boil the plastic and push it in the mold and there is uh, two or three injection point and usually those injection point are sealed but uh, in this case they were not. So I had to put some epoxy here, there, and there, and there. Because there was four injection point there. So that's what I did. Uh, you can actually see one there, right there. So you have to uh, epoxy in and out to make sure that it won't go through. And uh, actually did the job. It's no longer leaking. So as far as I know, it's good. No more problem there. And I did put some epoxy for my wire here. Either way, we're not gonna be playing with that that much. If there is something, I can always uh, lift up a little bit and put some more water if. The need is, but uh, that is actually really big, so I don't think uh, it's gonna be that much of a problem there. And if there is a problem, then I can always add myself an extension or 
drill a hole and have uh, something added down there and there's always a tons of possibility that I can do anyway that's where I'm at that's what it is plants are growing and um, definitely uh, I'm really anxious to see if it's gonna work with my uh, hydroponic uh, system there and I'm just waiting for my pH and uh, all those little devices there that I need to make sure that the water is uh, good for the plant all right see you you know so uh, my plant is currently growing uh, this is cucumber this one here and the other one there those two there are pak choy bok choy there it's a chinese plant that uh, we use in salad so i'm trying that out see if it's gonna work never planned on one of those before but uh, this is where I'm at with the grill. Uh, we're about maybe a week or two there. Uh, looks like we got good roots going on there. So eventually I will transplant those two, uh, maybe those four, in um, my aerial system, which uh, I'm almost finished working on.